Alright, how y'all doing? Major Slack here. Welcome back to the land of Far Cry 2. And now we're going to do the second UFLL mission, okay? Continuing my tutorial, my walkthrough of Act 1 of Far Cry 2, okay? Already did the first UFLL mission, and we did all the weapon shop missions. So now, all the, weapon sh all the weapons that can be made available in Act 1 are now available. And now it's just a matter of... Um, getting the diamonds together to buy up the weapons I'd like to have. Oops. <laughs> and uh, I've got most of the weapons I want. I've got the RPG-7 rocket launcher and I've got the Mac 10 equipped. Now I'd like to get the Dragonoff sniper rifle to replace my M1903 sniper rifle. This is a much better sniper rifle. So I'm going to be collecting some diamonds, as many diamonds as I can along the way of doing this mission so that I can buy up that, uh, that weapon there. So here we are at uh, Underground Safe House some diamonds around the back. If you just followed on the map where I was going, you'll see where this is. I'm going to try to engage the map as much as I can so you can just follow on the map where I'm going. Okay, so grab that up. <coughs> Eventually we're, we're going to go to town. But uh, on the way, see we're right near the southwest bus station, but on the way we're going to hit up that, that safe house because there's some more diamonds there and that's also a very strategic safe house to unlock so on the way we have to be mindful of this patrol here I'll show you when it comes along it goes right along this route here no it's not there yet and there's the safe house let's just whack a couple of these guys in the meantime coming? No. Okay, he's just stuck behind the building there. Okay, one guy's down. It's a three-man safe house. There they are. A couple more guys. They're definitely in alert mode. Let's see if I can whack that guy. Still no patrol. Great, got that guy. Two guys down. Here comes the patrol. And they look like they're in alert mode. They're going pretty fast. Yep, he is. Okay. So, rock and roll. Take care of those guys. Come and do their vehicle. Let's go finish off that last guy at the safe house there. Where's the party? <laughs> he heard Major Slack was coming to town. So, uh, no, I gotta find him though. <laughs> He's probably shooting his pants around the back of the building here. No? Where the fuck did you go? Don't make me. Okay, there he is. There you go. That's it. Safe house unlocked. And the diamonds are up in there. Let's go grab him. Grab those up. Cha-ching. Okay, six diamonds. That's great. So with the 15 diamonds we get from the second UFLL mission, we'll have 21 diamonds. Then that's enough to uh, this. that's enough to buy the uh, Dragonoff sniper rifle. Excellent. So let's head out to the bus station. It's right over here. And go back to town. bus to town and away we go all right rock and roll and I'm only gonna save the game at like at the end of bus trips or at safe houses or at weapon shops because I know some of you guys are playing on the console version of Far Cry 2 and you don't get to save the game anywhere you like as we privileged PC gamers do <laughs> So I'm going to go go along with those rules of engagement and only stay the game, uh, you know, at those particular spots there. All right. So that, those are the rules of engagement for me for this uh, walkthrough. Save the game, savey savey, and away we go. I should have checked the time at that save house. Oh well, no matter. 
Anyways, it, I think it was about one o'clock, so I took this bus, and now it's probably around five o'clock. Wait, I'll need your guns and all, man. I don't have any guns. Okay, I, I, I got a few guns. It's just a Mac 10. It's what I always bring to a business meeting. What can I say? <laughs> okay, so let me go to the UFLL headquarters upstairs and grab the mission. How'd you let this happen? Thank you for thinking that I control everything. Meet up with Dr. Kakumba no, no, and Carbonell. We're gonna take that gold and will be nothing left. We were the ones. That old king came to us. You're teaching the APR a good lesson. I most certainly am. Hey, Carbonell, what's happening? Look, he looks stoned out of his mind. You got some good timing, man. <laughs> Watch this. It's like he forgot his line. His line? <laughs> Come on, let's go, man. You know this Fubar country used to have a king. Okay. I'm serious, man. The hombre got a boatload of money from Europe back in the day, and then he took off. Okay. But he's back, and he brought his gold with him. A lot of gold. Okay. And that gold comes from our mines. It belongs to us. Right. Sure, man. You tell him. The gold is sitting out in an oasis in the northeastern desert. Millions of dollars sitting under a tarp. All of it protected by those stupid APR boys. We need some no-name cabron like you to go out there and find the gold. Send a text message with the location. Don't touch it. Okay, got it. It's not yours. Heard this bajillion, you know, bajillion times. Let just move along. Just interact with that folder there whenever you want him to skip the mission description and just give you the mission. Got it? Hit the Oasis, kill the guards, use your mobile to send us the location. It's gonna be good. Right. Go to the northeast, tag the gold. Got it. Nobody knows about this, got me? UFL out guys, see you. They'll shoot you on sight. You're on your own. Yeah, baby. yeah, yeah. Everybody out there is a son of a bitch. Your mama. <laughs> and it's going to shoot me on sight. Yeah, yeah. I kind of figured that out after doing the uh, first UFL mission and all the weapon shop missions. Yeah. But no friendlies out there. Okay. So, be warned, dudes and dudettes. That's the way it is in Far Cry 2. So, go up there to the northeast. Go into an oasis, go in a hole in the ground, find the gold, tag it, mission complete. Or, we can do it the subverted buddy mission. Take a phone call from Flora. Hi, it's Flora. Hello. I want to see you. Meet me at Lakeside, in the foothills. Alright. If we do it her way, go meet her at the safe house. She'll, she'll give us a couple of alternatives. Like a couple of side missions to do. If we do all that, and we'll get our safe house upgraded with... Uh, a mini med kit. So that's what we're gonna do. This walkthrough is gonna cover all those subverted side missions, okay? Subverted faction missions. So we're gonna head to that blue square eventually, but first I want to buy the Dragonoff sniper rifle because I have enough diamonds now. Been waiting for this. Here we are, 21 diamonds, that's great. We only need 20 diamonds. So uh, we gotta hit a weapon shop somewhere. Could go to the one at Mike's Bar, but that's five minutes round trip. I don't wanna do that. I think let's go to the weapon shop in the east sector. So we'll go to the southeast bus station and then drive north to the weapon shop there. And there's also a safe house there. And uh, yeah, I think we'll hit the safe house first. Because right now it's about 5 o'clock and each bus trip is about 4 hours. So when we get to the southeast sector, it's going to be about 9 o'clock, right around dusk. And the visibility is going to be terrible, especially if it's still raining. If it's still raining, the visibility is going to be terrible. So I want to hit up a safe house, sleep till next morning, get back in the daylight, and then continue from there. And then we'll go to the weapon shop, get the brand new sniper rifle, and we'll be golden. Right? <laughs> and save the game. And there's always a patrol that comes along this route here. Should I wait for it? Let's see if we can get away. I could have wait, waited and ambushed that patrol. The rocket for my rocket launcher bit. Try to move things along. Good, got away. Okay, so now we're driving north to the east sector. And there's a three man outpost here. I'm gonna drive on by that. Is that a guy there? So they give me some grief now. But they never follow you. They have a vehicle there, but oh fuck, they damaged my vehicle. Bummer. Oh, no, I'm Bummer. I hate repairing vehicles. I really hate. I hate it with a passion. <laughs> I should go back and whack them just for that. No, no, I'm not gonna do that. <laughs> you 
usually I'm able to run over one one guy out in the field there, but I didn't see him. It's too dark, too foggy. So with all three of them going at me, they managed to damage my vehicle. Okay, so now we're in the east sector, and see that safe house there, the flashing safe house just off to the left. So that's where we're going. Just gonna drive around here along this road here. I'm just gonna stop here because there's usually a patrol here. See if it's around. I can't see fuck all. Shit. This is the worst possible visibility. Foggy, rainy, and at and you know, at dusk. <laughs> Would actually be better if it was like the middle of the night. <laughs> 